Your brand new iPhone deserves the best protection, and the iLoon 3-pack screen protector plus 3-pack camera lens protector has you covered. Don't take risks with your iPhone. Click the link in the video description to shop now on Amazon. So, you're probably wondering what's new with Google's Find My Device feature. Well, get ready to have it rebranded as Find Hub, because that's exactly what just happened. In a recent announcement made during the Android show, a week before Google I.O. 2025, we learned that Google is expanding its Find My Device service in some big ways. For those who may not remember, Find My Device was first introduced back in 2013 as an alternative to Apple's Find My Service for Android users. Now, what's changing is the feature's name and the types of partners it will work with. Gone is the crowdsourced finding network that could locate personal belongings via third-party Bluetooth trackers and tags. Instead, we're seeing a whole new set of built-in location, tracking capabilities from brands like July and Makabara. These partnerships mean you'll be able to track down lost luggage or skis with just a few taps on your Android device. Even families can benefit from Pixby's new Bluetooth tags designed specifically for keeping tabs on the kids' gear. But that's not all later this month, Android users will get access to ultra-wideband technology to locate Motorola's Moto tags. And when it comes to airline partnerships, Google is partnering with Aer Lingus, British Airways, Cathay Pacific, Iberia, and Singapore Airlines to help travelers keep track of their luggage. Google also announced that support for satellite-based finding will roll out later in 2025, providing even more ways to locate lost items. So, whether you're searching for your phone or just want to find your way around the airport, Find Hub is here to help. Overall, it looks like Google is really ramping up its efforts to make Find My Device a one-stop shop for all your device tracking needs. With these new partnerships and features, Android users are going to have more ways than ever to keep tabs on their stuff. And that's a good thing if you ask me.